Welcome to Doc Pedigree Manager video tutorials. In this video, we are gonna take a closer look at the random dog image module. So here's the random dog image module on the left hand side. As you can see, uh, this module basically loads a different dog image uh, when the page is refreshed or user visits another page. So let's refresh the page and see what happens. So now I have refreshed the page and it has loaded a different dog image. So we can also link the image to the doc profile so when users click on it it will take you to the docs profile and the module has also loaded a different image now. Next let's take a look at the admin options associated with this random dog image module. So let's go to the admin area, module manager, click on the random dog image module. and on the right hand side you can see the parameters so the first option is the display dog name option so you can uh, choose to display the dog name under the dog image let's set it to yes and you can also link this name to the dog's profile okay let's set that to yes as well and let's click apply and let's go to the front end and let's refresh this page so as you can see uh, this has loaded a different dog image and also below it there is a there's the dog name and it is also linked to its profile so when users click on it it will take you to the dog's profile so let's get back to the admin area so under the module general settings uh, there is the container settings this is the uh, invisible div that holds the that wraps around the module so you can change the width you can change the padding and you can also apply any additional custom CSS that you want and then there is the image settings uh, this is the uh, settings for the image uh, you can change the image width height border uh, border color and you can also apply custom CSS in this field. Uh, lastly there is the name settings if you choose to display the dog name under the dog image then uh, you can change the font size of the text and you can also set the font color and you can also apply custom CSS for the dog name. So that's all for the random dog image module and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you for watching.